So here we have it, um, our, our very first coffee harvest. Look at that. Look at that steam rising. Wow. Oh. Never in a million years did I think that I would be drinking my own harvested coffee, our own harvested coffee. Uh, this is incredible. Praise God. To Him be the glory. And thank you guys also for making this possible. Today, Wilfredo uh, brought back our first fruit coffee harvest that has now been processed. We dried it ourselves and then we took it to our friend's coffee farm and he finished drying it a little bit longer because um, it needed to be at a level nine um, degree of humidity. Uh, it's just how they measure uh, how dry a coffee needs to be. And then they, <clears throat> they finished writing it out and then they roasted it for us. And um, look at this. A little over three pounds. It started out at probably around six, but then you lose half. And here we have it. Our first, our very first coffee harvest. Incredible, just incredible. How amazing. <laughs> never in a million years. Never in a million years. But I think that I, I would have, uh, you know, that we would be doing this. This is just amazing. I am going to drink a cup of coffee for all you friends and family. Uh, everyone who prays for us, for the Flores family. I'm going to enjoy a nice cup of coffee for you. And wishing that I was sitting next to you. Uh, enjoying a nice conversation. We are going to uh, try this even though it is past 6.30 uh, and it's always a risk drinking coffee, but you know what? Uh, let me have at it. Yes. Wow. Wow. We further just said, thank you, Father. We bless this coffee, the first fruits. May multiply. May there always be coffee flowing. So here we have it. Um, our, our very first coffee harvest. Look at that. Look at that steam rising. Wow. Oh. Never in a million years did I think that I would be drinking my own harvested coffee. Our own harvested coffee. Uh, this is incredible. Praise God. To Him be the glory. And thank you guys also for making this possible. I wish you, each and, each and one of you were sitting right here with me, enjoying this cup of coffee. Even those that didn't, uh, don't drink coffee, uh, you know that's no way to live, right? Uh, but uh, <laughs> enjoying a nice conversation. God bless you. Negro, black, it's good. No sugar, no cream. That's pretty good. Today we are making, what are we making, girls? Fruit roll-ups. Fruit roll-ups. Out of what? What's this yellow stuff? Bananas? No. Yellow peppers? Ew, that would, ooh, yellow pepper roll-ups? Would that be? No. What is it? Pineapple. That's what, that's what we blended here in this Ninja, or I'm sorry, Nutribullet. <laughs> and uh, we've poured it onto this. I've added actually a little, a little bit of honey. A little bit of honey, see? A little bit of honey. Okay. Um, maybe spread it out a little bit more, I think. We can do it. We can do it. And then we're gonna pop it into the dehydrator. And we're gonna slide it in the second one. The second one. Ooh, nice. We're gonna we're only gonna use about three, so we don't wanna use all of them. Good job. So we're gonna take these off. All right. You ready for a second one, Mila? Cool. Here comes Eliana. You wanna put that one right there. Awesome. 
Almost six hours later, we have, we are pulling out our pineapple fruit roll-ups. Remember we did three. Okay, and we'll just, uh, we can put that one, let's put that one, let's put that one on here. Okay, we're gonna let these cool off a little bit. Okay, and then we do have, can you pull that one out, honey? I want to show everybody, because I didn't show everybody what, what this is. So, Daddy made a apple. green apple, and our cinnamon little container broke, so otherwise I would have sprinkled some cinnamon on there. Girls, what are we doing? We are sealing uh, dry candy. Yes, sealing dry candy. So, um, Maya, do you want to go get the other um, jar here? So we have two. Okay, hold on. Okay. Uh, so that's the other jar. Tell us about this jar. Oh yeah, once it's empty, we're gonna use it for cookies. So this one's unopened yet, yeah. right? It's sealed. Yeah. Um, and that's how this one was. And now um, what we're doing is uh, doing some food prepping, food storaging for the future. Yeah. And so tell us about the process. What, Myla, what do you do first? How many are you putting in here? So we're putting 22, um, a little bit more because the bags are big. Oh, okay, 22. Are those yummy candies? Yeah. Those are yummy hard candies. Okay, so approximately how much does 22 uh, weigh? Eliana? Four ounces. Four ounces, good job. So we're doing 22. Okay. And I'm laying them down. Oh. So what daddy has been doing is uh, taking this roll of uh, bags and I've been cutting uh, bags big enough for this. And then Eliana, you are sealing them, right? Mm -hmm. That one's already sealed. The At the bottom. Okay, and then now you're doing what? Vacuum. Vacuum sealing it. Awesome, you just press the like button. Oh wow! Look at that that so was satisfying. quick. Yes. It's so satisfying. Yes, and by the way, thank you, Miss Kelly. Right? Thank you, Miss Kelly, for giving us this machine. Bless you. Um. So now, Myla, Eliana will date it with a permanent marker. Let me put them in a plus big. Plastic bag and then... Yeah, oh, the big plastic bag is right here. You so, only made five. So out of this jar, we have gotten... This is our six vacuum sealed bag. It looks like we're going to get at least one more. All right? So about seven four-ounce bags. What's seven times four? Or four times seven? Uh, 28? 28! Yes, yeah, so we got 28 ounces, which, by the way, um, isn't that, but that, isn't that like um, 50 pounds? Yeah. But Daddy, can we put the That's almost two pounds. Bag? That's almost two pounds. Two pounds would be 32 ounces. Daddy, can we put the rest in this bag? Yes. Well, actually, uh, what we'll do is that we'll mix some of that with this. Okay. With the new jar. Does so that sound fair? Yeah. Sounds really fair. Awesome.